Hey, what's up? This is Jax Jones. This is Enter Zagreb. Hi, Jax. Uh, nice to see you. Nice to meet you. Nice Welcome to, you. to Croatia, to Zagreb. How Thank are you? you? Oh, I'm really good. First time in Zagreb. Okay. I'm, yeah, having a little chat. It's very cold outside, so that's why I've got my jacket on. Oh, uh, we don't mind it. Do you prefer summertime or winter? Ooh, I think I like both because you don't appreciate summer without winter. And it's nice when winter comes and it's like, oh, you can, okay. yeah, spicy, isn't it? And you get hot wine and all that. It's yeah. nice. <laughs> so tell me, what is your real name? I cannot pronounce it, so please pronounce it instead of me. Um, my real name is Timochin Gongwa Lam. Oh. <laughs> For all you kids out there, <laughs> you have uh, some something uh, of uh, Turkish. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, I'm half Turkish and half Chinese. So Timochin's a Turkish name, and Gongwa is a Chinese name. So uh, why did you choose Jax Jones? Oh, so in the UK, there's a like a slang term. You say on your Jack Jones. It, it's from from East London, and it means to do something on your own. And this, when I started as Jack Jones, it was like uh, the first time that I was doing things for myself, doing it on my own, representing myself. So that was hence the symbol of the name. So uh, how do your friends call you? Oh, oh, they just call me Tim. Tim. Or Young G. Young or G. My, my guy. <laughs> Since you mentioned it, I, I uh, read somewhere that you used to rap when you were 15. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I, I was an excellent rapper. I, I, um, I was a good rapper, but then I was, I think I went to, they had this shop in the West End uh, called Deal Real. And everyone, it was like a record store and then everyone would go and rap for two minutes, kind of like Eight Mile with mm -hmm. Eminem. Mm -hmm. So you go and do that. Yeah. And no one liked my raps. <laughs> so that was the end of my rap career. <laughs> uh, so uh, you prefer old school, right? R&B? <laughs> yeah, also. yeah, that's right. But I like new R&B as well. Like, yeah. it, I think that was the music I listened to when I was growing up. So everyone listen. Everyone loves the music they listen to growing up. It, and some people don't move on. I love a lot of new music. Uh, so how do you feel about trap music as a genre? Oh, I love it. I love Troy Boy. He's like the only one I know. <laughs> no, I love Troy Boy. I love uh, Flosh Adamus. I went through a phase that I thought I was going to be a trap DJ. But those guys are too talented for me. I, I just, not saying house music is easier, but it's kind of easier to make than trap music. <laughs> okay, so let's move on to house music. Your latest single, Play. Yeah. You uh, have years and years featured on it, and it sounds amazing. So how did you two come up with uh, that single? Oh, thank you very much first. Uh, we, I've been a fan of years and years for a while mm -hmm. and I was putting it out in the interviews that oh, I want to work with years and years and then we have a mutual friend this guy called Mark Ralph who's a producer and we work together on stuff and he produced all of the years and years music as well so I just begged him and begged him and begged him and then one day Ollie yeah. decided to come and we just got on really well danced around a lot I had my guitar, he was singing, and that's when we wrote the song. The first day was a terrible song that no one's gonna hear. And then the second day was play. So mm -hmm. yeah, it was cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm sure it's going to climb on the charts as, yeah, as well as your- It's had a good start. Yes, it's yes. had a good start. Thank you for <laughs> the plays that you've given and the ones of you will course. give. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for giving us such a, such a, how do you say that? Uh, Quality, quality house music. Oh, yes. Um, yes, yes. We just could say house bangers. House that's bangers. bangers. Yeah, that's right. House bangers. So uh, you have like a distinctive sound yeah. on your every song, like what what you're gonna do. Yeah, yeah. Uh, did you plan to do it, or was it like uh, by accident? Oh, uh, it was by ac well, kind of by accident. It was I did a song a few years ago called Housework, mm -hmm. and it's like more underground song but the it was like i call it housework yeah. uh because it's light work and then it goes what you what Which you go and do yeah. and then i was like oh this is dope so then i just used it on all my songs similar to i don't know if you know some of the older producers like timberland yeah, and pharrell so they always used to put their 
kind of vocal tags mm-hmm. on songs and so I just did the same yeah it's it's a nice to uh, have a distinction from other DJs. yeah so yeah. the idea is when you hear what you what you go and do yeah. you, know you know you're gonna love the song you know <laughs> it's a house yes, banger <laughs> okay so how are you connected with the food you have like obsession with the cornflakes or uh, snacks yeah, yeah yeah each each song has each single has a uh, its own food <laughs> um oh oh yeah, yeah and uh, <laughs> This is my actually. This is a gift to me. Yeah, like this to is in my breath. <laughs> <laughs> May yeah, you never have smelly breath yeah. again. I'm actually. Yes. I need that actually. Oh, oh, the ladies first. Oh, Hold thank on. you so there much. There you go. Two, because <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hold on, so three for me. Was it was it mm. uh, like on the single breathe? Was Murray needs some. Oh, Yo, he's got the breathe ones. You have. Yeah. Oh, come on, bring them. Oh, <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Yeah, you <laughs> see, it. zoom in. My one's better yeah. than theirs. Trust me. Of course. Me. <laughs> this is just like a copy. Cheap yeah, exactly. Copy. Cheap. Oh, <laughs> these guys, they'll take them to court. Face the. But um, what we say? No, food is like. Again, it started with my first song, Housework. And I don't know if you remember some classic art pieces by Andy Warhol with the mm-hmm. mushroom soup. Yeah. And this style of art I was like oh yo we could do something like this for the artwork of housework mm. and then it we just loved it so much that we kept it going and it's just evolved into something really cool and it's a world that I can get really creative with and it's really fun to take things that are iconic and make it Jack Jones yeah. you know <laughs> so if you were a food which food would you be I, I would be have you ever heard of dim sum no. It's a Chinese food, and what oh. it is, it's like a, it's like a dumpling. Okay. Okay, and it's my favorite food. And dim sum in Chinese means little gift. So I'll be a dim sum. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> like a little gift. I'm a little gift. Yeah. <laughs> Small and cute. <laughs> exactly. So, uh, do you have any plans for new singles, album, maybe coming up, collaborations? Yeah, 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 yeah. I got so obviously we've got play out mm. at the moment and gonna let that do its thing and then i've got more music than i've ever had stockpiled i've been working hard this year so i can go on holiday for a bit but the uh i have about some really big singles some with other djs some with some other big singers and can more be please, revealed please over time please. over time it's what my favorite part other than making the song is when you do the big like mm-hmm. and it was like <laughs> this my so you gotta let me have that okay. in the future if I give it away now then I don't get to go <laughs> you you're, you're behind the curtains the big reveal like and behind the, the, is <laughs> <"Wah!"> <laughs> yeah exactly so okay just uh, first letter of a singer <laughs> <laughs> or one letter of a singer's name like A <laughs> uh, H H yeah which letter is that it's like H H H H Harry no <laughs> it's not a boy oh, is it a girl is maybe it it's a, a transgender <laughs> <laughs> you're very modern <laughs> very modern okay uh, so uh, what are your plans for New Year's Eve ooh I'm not sure yet I like I'll probably end up doing a show I've got some some shows booked in and I was planning whatever happens if I do end up doing a show I'm gonna get um, a bus for me and my friends and we're just oh. gonna party bus to New Year's Eve and then on New Year's Day though mm-hmm. I go to South Africa for safari which I can't wow. wait for so I'm gonna see some lions some tigers and all that should be sick. have you seen the new trailer for the Lion, Lion King, King movie? yo I, I've seen every meme related to it, but I haven't actually seen the trailer yet. Like, first, uh, I know the memes first. Yes, memes first, then <laughs> then trailer. Yeah, but it looks sick. They say my favorite meme is the um, if the old Lion King is the Android and the new okay. Lion King is iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite meme right now. <laughs> okay, we're going to put this meme because of you on our Instagram. Yes. <laughs> Not that Lion King needs any more exposure. Everyone's yes. talking about it. It was the most watched trailer of all time. Yeah, trending. Yeah, Absolutely. incredible. 
Okay, uh, so um, your mom listens to your <laughs> music oh, yeah. as well. And <laughs> what does she Good say? Old Mama Jones. Yeah. <laughs> no, my mom texts me late at night. Really? Yeah, the other night. And she just said, yeah. It's cool, I like the, your new song, but I think Breathe is better. And I was like, all right, cool, thanks, mum. <laughs> and my dad said it to me today as well. Yeah, I wasn't very happy about that. No. <laughs> First thing he said to me today, I went to see him today because it's his birthday next week. And then he says, oh yeah, I think your Breathe is better. It's yeah. like, he said, this is his exact word, he says, it's high tech. Oh. Like, oh cool. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay, uh, so you also, um, you also are preparing new shows next year? Mm. Yeah? I've got... In London? In London. Yeah. So it's only two hours away. You can come to London. We we'll are be ready. invited, okay? Very, we'll invite you formally. I'll make sure there's some Tic Tacs there. <laughs> but the, it's um, our biggest... How can I say? My, I do big festivals and stuff, but it's <laughs> our biggest headline show that we've ever done. 3,000 people should be really good. It's in the oh. famous Camda Roundhouse. And so many people have performed there. It's an iconic venue, so awesome. it's going to be sick. If you ha held a festival, mm. uh, who would be headliner? Except from you. Apart from myself. Yeah. I wouldn't headline myself. No? No. 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 <laughs> wouldn't pay myself enough. <laughs> <laughs> um, who would headline? Mm, I would love... On the lineup, I would have N.E.R.D. Because mm. I love Pharrell. I'd have... Um, and who would, who would I get to head like? Duke? Duke Dumont? Maybe. Maybe? <laughs> <laughs> I'd have Rihanna Come headline on. just because oh. then I can talk to her backstage. Yeah. Say, you enjoying the festival, Rihanna? Yeah. It's like, yeah, oh, crr, oh yeah, cool. <laughs> I say, do you mind if I, uh, you know, I've got my whole studio here. Do you mind? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, uh, so uh, that's this is it. I think this is it for the. That was abrupt. The, yeah. Okay. If you have something else to add, maybe what what do you like to do in your free time when you're not making music? When I'm not, I like to watch a lot of horror films. Horror films. I like to, so I like to be scared. Um, I like to eat. You should check my bank account. What? Oh, <laughs> to because, be scared. Yeah, yeah. That was good. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. That was quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> that was excellent. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and with that, yeah. that is one of my other hobbies. I like to check my bank account. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> Someone enter Zagreb radio. What's good? Yes. Pay the people. Yes. Pay the people. Yes. And that's of what I want to say. It's a petition to pay Tara, <laughs> you know, Tara more than what she's getting now. She's got things to do. Yes, exactly. Thank you. Thank you. My boss is going to fire me after this, but uh, okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, thank you so much. I uh, enjoy your uh, your night. Thank it you. was uh, so much fun talking to you, and uh, hope to see you again in Zagreb or London or at the Roundhouse in London, a uh, April sixth, if you want. <laughs> of course. Cool. That's it. <laughs>